so here's our workshop guys and this is where we can repair our vehicle hello guys and welcome back to a cave today we have a first look at pear farming 2018 i want to first i want to of course say huge thanks to uh, techland for giving me a preview copy of the game uh, now this is a not a full released version of a game it doesn't include a uh, few things and uh, mainly doesn't include campaign uh, so I just want to share my opinion about the game what I'm thinking and um, actually it's my first time to play it so here's the main menu so we have a free farming it's pretty much like a farming simulator mod we have a farming challenges and it's kind of a scenario that you just have to like play and give you some um, like option uh, task to finish scenario uh, and stuff like that of course we have a add-ons uh, right now it's uh, like different clause for farmer and a Germany map that we going to play in free farming mode also you can customize the way your character looks like here's the set if you want to change something is it horn? Yeah. Of course, options and stuff like this. Pretty, pretty much, uh, let's start the game. Uh, we don't have any option at this point uh, as far as the maps goes. Uh, let's increase our step start balance for 600,000. Um, also, here's the modification. Um, the way I understand, uh, game will, I'm not sure, it's a pure speculation, but hopefully game will have some option to create mods from a uh, community, for community, so this can bring a lot more to a game in the future, but we don't have any mods right now, and we're just gonna start free game. So. Here's the pretty much take forage and markets by storm. Do you feel like you have accomplished everything on your farm? Would you like to try something new? Farmer's life isn't limited to Montana. Of course, it's a, I guess it's going to be a first available map. Forage and markets are waiting for you. Try your hand and... Oh, sorry, didn't finish reading. But pretty much blah, 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 encouraging people. So here's our farm. This guy is. For some reason it's, he reminds me of Squirrel, like the YouTuber Squirrel. So this is a pretty small map. Um, let's view our pad. Here's the map. Not whole lot to it, and I think because it's just like a, it's, like I said, it's a pre-released version. Uh, you have butcher. You have. Wool Purchase Center, uh, Canal Silo, and I think it's... A... Okay, hold on. For some of the reason, we have a traffic through our farm. Uh, oh well. Okay, let's go back to the map. So, uh, Milk Sale Point. Now, here is a, a Logistics Center, Trade Center. And stuff like that. Here's our ship. Lamps. Ship old. Uh, cows. And I think it should be a pig somewhere, but I am not sure. And here is our food market. Rabbits. And small farm. And I think it's only one field available right now. We have to create field on our own. But... Here's our interface, it's a like main menu, it's give like, hello, um, number of greenhouses, number of windmills, number of fields, number of machines and equipment, and I guess it's like a golden nuggets from farming simulator, 
this is what it is in this game i think you have to collect and you get money in reward uh statistics greenhouse uh, orchard animal workers farming economy and renewable energy this is what uh is the uh, electric windmills and stuff like that come goes to also you can purchase canola grass fertilizer neutral natural fertilizer i guess it's a manure and stuff like that uh i guess just in this pre-built pre uh, preview build it's only canola available selling animals we have pig rabbits sheep stock market that is new oh it's pretty much like a shows you what the current prices and if they change it and bank application so you can take a loan up to hundred thousand installment 30 months I believe in about 3600 okay uh, player status of course uh, ship barn oops I don't know what happened something happened uh, the equipment and just pretty much your basic stats now here's your vehicle store and currently uh, I don't know if it's a final version and I really hope it's not because it's a little bit uh, everything you know like in one pile right now so we're going to take a look at um, here, the we have a Zetor tractors Landini what else do we have uh, JCB McCormick Agramash so I guess one two three four yeah uh, five tractors combines uh, we have a gum cell mesh Agramash Redlands and I believe this is the you get information it's a rice harvest harvesting for rice harvesting okay let's go change the loca location where we're looking at stuff because this yeah that thing the driving and music okay let's go back to our vehicle store So, and we have Gregorio, it's, what is this for? Oh, it's a, for olive harvesting, for coffee harvesting we have Skyberry, and uh, it's it, cultivation now, the one thing uh, currently I have the biggest issue like it's not uh, it's not really sorted out so you don't have like plow and cultivate cultivators in a separate categories which is kind of a little bit tough but you have like a Eastern European companies and I probably because the game is in a, like a brand new game, so they couldn't require uh, get a pretty like pretty decent licenses from uh, some big companies like Class or Fent, and uh, definitely John Deere would never release the license because they you know mean. Let's say mean, yeah, mean. Okay, uh, we have uh, Forage and Wagon. Um, mowers, food mixers, balers, 
uh, rakes, but baler trailers, wrappers, and what is this? Is oh, it, and it's a sprayer. Loaders, we have a um, well JCB, pretty uh, bail uh, bail gripper. Now, rare load, rare loader. That is a new. Okay, so you pretty much can attach to attach to the tractor. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice. This is new. Really could use in the farming simulator. And weights and so and if we need to sell stuff. So here is the encyclopedia, fields, greenhouses, and you pretty much you can read everything you want. And our map. And here we go. The we're gonna take a quick tour around the map. On this little drone. So here. Let me let me like uh, put him so you can guys see see the drone. Nope. Oops. So here. That is a better view. And activate the drone. I really like I really enjoy the drone flying, so here, uh, here's our map, it's a small map and I, I believe because of the, the current version I have of a game. Store, gas station. Like, it's not a whole lot of view. For the drone but it's gonna guys give you an idea now one of the things i discovered you can buy actually field but let's buy a field let's let's purchase it so when i when you're in a drone mode it's actually give you a stats of the field what's going on what is pretty cool uh, Here is our cow farm, greenhouse, and our... So the tractors, you can repair tractors, it's a repair mod is in the game, which is amazing. And I will get to it in a little bit. So let's exit and let's go check our rabbits and... Uh, Oops, it's landed. Okay, so here's our rabbit farm, and let's let's build one. Let's. So five thousand capacity, twenty-five rabbits. Let's purchase some animals. Actually, you just press I and you, like, and they're gonna just be added. Sorry about the sound. Here, we have some rabbits. Also on the right side you have a stats, how old they are, when to sell them and stuff like that. Weird animals. Okay, so you can build other three cages if you want. Now let's go check our tickets actually let's get get in a vehicle we're gonna have to travel a lot oops uh now i didn't adjust my settings i'm not the best driver out there on the beginning so hopefully i'm not gonna crash in anywhere and we uh what okay so that is a uh, vegetables and fruit storage 
thing I'm entering? No, I cannot. Hey, how the heck we are getting in? Oh, road quite a bit far away. So here we uh, grow our chicken and yes, getting our eggs for farm. Let's build one. Let's see what it's gonna look like. So 5,000 capacity, 10 chickens. Ooh, that is a big building. Ooh yeah. Let's purchase some chickens. So yeah, uh, I guess you can get the eggs and you know, when chickens getting bigger, older or whatever, you can sell them. Now that is a speculation, so I am not sure about that. Okay, let's get some chickens. Oh, look, look, look at the small little chickens. Oh, it's so cool. They actually, they actually like, oh my goodness. Okay, so they, they have to grow and start. Oh, yes, they're gonna get bigger, you can sell them. Oh, I'm a horrible person, sometimes. Ooh. They're so adorable. Gosh, guys, it's like I need, I need to pu uh, put a huge sign right here, like a 15 miles. Oh yeah, how about that? Yes, I have a traffic jam. My farm. I'm the boss. Weird sounds. Oh, hold on. Can I do something? Oh, it's just okay. Never mind. Let's let's move the vehicle. Otherwise, we're gonna have a bunch of cars here. By the way, this is the inside view. If anybody wonders, I have no idea what this Mitsubishi looks like inside in the real life. So, okay, sheep. So how this is our sheep? What this looks like? Okay. How many we can buy? Sorry about the sound, guys. So, 35 lamps currently. Ooh. Also, a little and cute. Ooh. Uh, apparently, they, it's actually 35 of them there. Maybe. I don't know, I'm not gonna count. Okay, let's get it back in our car and we're gonna check. Let's go see uh, about cows. And this is what I was saying. I wasn't best driver in the farming simulator and I'm definitely not gonna be any good at her farming. Oh my goodness. I really, yeah, I, I think I should adjust. Uh, I should adjust settings as far as the setting. Okay, so here's our cow farm. Let's wondering how much this is gonna cost us. Twenty-five thousand. Let's see. Ooh, it's a pretty good size of building. So one cow cost 220 euros and you can upgrade the building for 50,000. Since we have a money, let's upgrade the building. Here is our cow spot. That's a pretty good size of building, guys. What do you think? Let's purchase. How many? I think we have. We can have 45 cows. Can we? Yeah, 45. 
Ok. Yeah, I don't think it's a 45 cows here, but whatever. Uh, I guess you cannot use the horse. And here's our greenhouse. Let's. Okay, so we can choose which one uh, the greenhouse we're gonna build. So let's do it for cabbages. Yay! Hey guys! Also, we can upgrade. That's a big greenhouse. Wow. And we can change crops. Let's do it to tomatoes, see how it's gonna change it. Okay. Uh, hmm. I guess I cannot enter. Okay, and the last things in this episode, guys, I want to show you is um, vehicle repairing system. Actually, let's get in a tr our tractor, hook up a plow. Oops! Like I said, nope, no driving skills whatsoever. Now remember this field we uh, we bought. I'm gonna run um, a one like a one run with a blow. Let's take a drop. Actually, why why are we come going here? Okay, so we are going to our field. We're just gonna do a one run, so you have an idea what it's gonna look like. So let's unfold it. Physics actually are more realistic than a vanilla farming simulator, that's for sure. Are Good to go. Now I'm not sure if the vehicle can get dirty or not. I would assume, and I hope so, but. I'm not sure about this one. Okay, uh, oops. Now let's go check our garage. Also, it's rotated, could be rotated too.
So here's our workshop, guys, and this is where we can repair our vehicle. Let's exit and uh, F. Well, our vehicle in, is in a perfect condition, but this is, guys, how you can repair vehicles and, um, you know, your equipment.